The O'Fallon Fire Protection District is making O'Fallon residents safer with a major upgrade in their fire truck fleet. This new pumper will be placed into service at Station 3, located at 600 Laura Hill Road, just east of Highway K. Actually, what we just took possession of is a new uh, Pierce truck. It's a 2012. Uh, the rescue called the rescue pumper, and it's called the rescue part of it because it's got a lot of compartment space for rescue equipment. Uh, and then of course, the, the pumper part. So it gives us that option to pump and roll when we uh, put the pump in gear. We can actually roll the truck along, so if we've got a grass fire along the highway or something like that, we can actually roll along the highway and, and uh, work on putting that fire out. The new pumper truck will be equipped with a full complement of firefighting equipment and state-of-the-art electrically powered hydraulic rescue tools capable of forcing open just about any car. In this case, it's got more room. You know, it's, it's uh, again, state-of-the-art. It's got more room. We've got a lot more compartment space. Uh, the Hearst tool, our rescue equipment, is all will be up to date. We've got a, an electric powered uh, hydraulic equipment on, on this one. So uh, it makes everything easier to run, easier to maintain. Here's a first-hand look at a couple of the nifty features on the new Pierce fire truck. We've compartmentalized things. We know what we're going to put in it, what equipment's going in each compartment. Uh, here's our control for our light tower. We have uh, 4,000 watt lights on top that we can raise up in the air to light up our scene and make things safe for us. All runs by remote control. Here's our pump panel. Uh, this is kind of what happens with the whole truck. Here's where the water is operated from. It has an onboard foam system. All is operated from this panel. This is how we turn on all our, all the water that's released from this truck comes from this panel. Foam operations. And again, we can put it in a compartment where we've closed it up on all our other trucks. It's always a, uh, stands out in the open and road grime seems to affect it. So we've closed it up and put it behind uh, the door here to cure it. So if you find yourself in an emergency, be comforted in the fact that O'Fallon's Fire Protection District has the latest tools to keep our residents safe. It just makes more compact, we can get more things on a truck, maybe less trucks to a scene, and, and sometimes that's important when we don't get those trucks there. We bring more equipment with each truck uh, to the scene.